Hey there folks, I'll excuse the lighting, it's a little dark in here, it's a little late so I'm trying to make too much noise, but anyways, here's some of my latest finds that I'm going to be selling on Kijiji. They are, number one is this Techniques receiver, it is a SA626 receiver, um, 65 watts of channel at 8 ohms. It was made um, 81, 82 roughly. Um, original price of this unit was $585. Um, it's a quartz synthesizer digital analog stereo receiver. It's in pretty nice shape. There is one little mark on the face. You won't really be able to see it, but I'm just going to put my finger on it. Right at the, I guess, the uh, treble button, right at the bottom, right where my finger is, is a little chip. In the actual faceplate. Other than that, she's in beautiful shape. The other thing I have going with it is this turntable, which is a Techniques SLB2. Sorry, I know it's kind of fuzzy in here. Like I said, the lighting is not that great. And with this unit, I'm throwing in these Acoustic Lab speakers. They're two way bass reflex speakers. Minimal wattage is, um, I believe it's 10 watts, maximum 70 watts. Um, they're liquid cooled, so on and so forth. They're pretty good. Um, they're not bad. Some of you might recognize these from my other video with my Yamaha receiver. Which, yes, these are the same speakers. However, I did not sell them with that receiver. I still happen to have them. So, here goes nothing. I'm going to throw this on. Um, the record's not perfect, perfect. There's a little bit of scratchy in the beginning, but it shouldn't be too bad. Um, I'm going to throw on right, these guys. So, here goes nothing, and away we go.
And just to throw the tuner on here. And to get your song out there like Johnny Hawk. Coming up next, we'll check out a band called Exit, going back to the 70s. And, uh, hey. Last from the past. Talking to me one. Basically, that's the system. It will be going on Kijiji. Um, anything else they would like to know, just send me a message and I'll let you know what I can. Um, it'll be Kijiji in Toronto is where I'll be listing it. So if anybody's interested, they can take a look. Um, I'm going to let it go pretty cheap, I think. Basically, somewhere in around... Actually, you know what? Look at the ad. You'll find out then. All right. Ciao for now, folks.